Good evening, everyone. My name is C Taskins, Code Primate, and welcome to another Lumber Tycoon 2 uh, video. I had uh, just jumped in, and somebody said, uh, Come to my base, bro. And he said, uh, Where is it? Uh, can you give me money? Bro, don't blacklist. And he said, Come to my base, IYT. I think, where was it? Oh, it was funny. Hold on. No, I can't find it. Well, poop. <laughs> wow. Anyhow, welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2 video. Uh, one of the best is around. And uh, this is my base. It, I, I think it's all loaded. Is it loaded? Yeah, we're loaded in. So... Let's go drop off some axes and get get our get our stuff all ready because I want to build bins. I got motivated by uh, Jingle <clears throat> to go and start creating. A, a, oh, excuse me. I'm sorry. I like I totally just straight burped into the microphone and that was disgusting. Code, don't ever do that again. That's nasty. Um, I got motivated to go and create. All right, we're gonna get rid of that rusty axe and grab an end times. There we go. Ooh, oh, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. What, 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 what? <clears throat> wow, can you give me money, please, boss? <laughs> Wait, is somebody? Oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Still in there. There you go. All right, shut the door. Woo! So I, I'm motivated now to go and create some uh, wood bins for a sorting machine like Jingle's got, and I also I want to cover up the base, like. I love how his base had walls all around it where you can't just take and like push people's stuff off like and then like you know and it's got like a second story to it so he's got more room than anybody else that I know so I'm motivated <clears throat> hugely hugely motivated to do so hi guys oh my gosh code prime what's up bro how do you get all this stuff? Bands. <laughs> They're gonna be like fans. Wait, what? <laughs> um. Oh, here I can destroy that because it was just a little one, and we had um. Did we have red presents? We do. We've got red presents over here. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Excuse, excuse me. Sorry, I gotta be Karen here for a second. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, sir. There we go. Woo. And I, I am kind of ignoring everybody inside the chat. I'm sorry. Um, but <clears throat> something that we have an abundance of that on this particular base we can get a lot of is palm wood. So let's do that and let's start in with just large floors. Uh, rotate, turn, rotate. And I'm just going to start right... Oh, actually, hold on. We need to go right here. Right? I think. Boom. One. Two. Uh, three. Code Prime, you give me X! Give me stuff! Give me all your stuff! Four. Five. Oh, oh, uh, looks like I'm stuck there. Uh, I'm gonna have to destroy this stuff, aren't I? Um, yeah, it's it's in times. It's in times. We can we can get more of this. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, you guys, you guys! <laughs> I'm trying to build here. <laughs> guys, <laughs> I'm recording. I'm trying to build. <laughs> Can I have money? I will buy power to build Roblox Studio. Okay. Okay. <clears throat> Roblox Studio. Do you need the power? <clears throat> Do you need the power? Do you need the power? Do you need the power? Here. Come with me. Come with me. 
Oh gosh, oh gosh. It's gonna be glitchy. It's like super glitchy. Alright. He got in. He he's good. He's good. <laughs> By the way, if you guys haven't seen this yet, uh, this is an amazing little trick with the uh, small blueprints that uh, I figured out. They're like, wow. <laughs> You're not going to wow yet, dude. Wait until you see this stuff. Come on, come on. Rotate one more time. Rotate, 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 rotate. There you go. Do, 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 do. And I should be able to turn, turn, turn. Uh-oh. There we go, there we go. Skills, skills. Uh-oh, now I'm stuck. skills. Whoa, that truck just appeared out of nowhere. Alright, Roblox Studio. Prepare to be amazed. Get ready to jump. Okay. Here we go. Turn. Uh oh. I think I may have made a wrong turn. Okay, hold on. <clears throat> Let's try our filter. Blank. Roblox. Game. Properties. No, uh, not properties. Filters. Color correction. Alright, do, oh. do we see anything anywhere? Yes, this way. Up here, dude. Up here. I found it. <laughs> what is this? Wow. <laughs> you really need the power? I'm recording you. He goes, wait. Yes. Okay. Was it 10 million, 9,000? Going to Roblox Studio. So let's hit B for done. Menu. Send money to Roblox Studio. Ten million nine thousand. I think that's it. Ten million nine thousand. Here you go, bud. Sent. Boom. Boom. <laughs> oh, this sucks. I'm gonna I'm gonna lose my axe, aren't I? That's okay. I can come back down here. What will I do now? Build with ease, like a boss. And yeah, have fun. <laughs> yeah, reset. There we go. <clears throat> Must reset. <laughs> okay, so I don't actually need any axes per se at the moment. 
uh, what I do need is one of these right here. You know what? I'm, go I'm gonna build up the wall around my base first. We'll do that. And then, uh, yeah. By the way, Happy New Year, everyone. Um, if you've been keeping track, this is the last video of the Lumber 2019 series. It is the last one, guys. What a year. We hit, uh, we had a book deal release. We hit 100,000 subscribers. Uh, we, we're at 111,000, so that's... <clears throat> we've had 11,500 since the, uh, since we hit 100,000. Code Prime. Hi. A lot of people are asking me to give them an axe. I'm I'm not gonna whitelist anyone. I'm sorry. I'm just not. I'm not gonna do it. I'm I'm fearful of whitelisting people. By the way, I really like the idea of. Um, hold on. Let's make this the the red. The firewood. Hi. Hello. Hi. Dude, are those Ready Player One goggles? Are those Ready Player One Go Googles? Goggles? <laughs> Idle. <laughs> Thank you. Can you add me? I have a rule. <laughs> A rule. No add. Sorry. I can follow. Here, I'll give you a follow. I'll give you all a follow. Because you happen to be here. Follow player. Follow player. Follow player. Oh, what was that? Oh, I guess they're following me. Follow player. Mutual follows will get doubles. Mr. Cool Chair. Follow player. There we go. There we go. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, let's head over here. No, 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 no. I remember what I wanted to do. Um, the floodlights with the the cool little things. I love the way those looked and worked. Uh, can you join me if I play? If you happen to land in the same server as me. I'm not going to... By the way, <clears throat> um, I kind of want to talk to you about this because it's been happening more and more frequently. The relationship that you and I have, I want this to be perfectly clear. Um, I have a celebrity status. Okay, so it's... I want you to be 100% sure that like this this is not this is not a two-way relationship if that makes sense. And I know this is this is going to kind of hurt for some people, but um, a lot of people say I love you and you're my idol and you do so much for me. Guys, I am a YouTuber on the internet that just I make videos and content and I do it with the knowledge that, the knowing that you're going through a hard time or you're going to have a rough day or that you're going to have um, days that you felt like I felt whenever I was younger and you needed someone to give, you know, a, a, a moment of caring. And I do. I care about your emotional state and I care about your mental well-being. But on that same note, I need to make sure that you understand this is, it's really one way. A lot of people get it um, stuck in their mind that I'm their friend. And I've, I've never met some of them before. And that's, that's okay as long as you think of it in a healthy manner. I'm not your idol. I don't want you worshipping me. I don't think of myself as any more than just another player inside a game that you're playing as well. Okay, yeah, the difference is I happen to be 38 years old, married with two kids, a wife, and a family life, and I make content. Okay? So, thank you all for the love and for everything else. I do, I do. I love you guys very much, and I want you to understand 
there's a relationship barrier or a relationship boundary not a barrier it's it's definitely a boundary and i don't want you to think that like oh code primate will come and play with me inside my server and help me build my base no i won't not that i don't want to and not that i haven't done it in the past and i do it at random but it's not <laughs> gamer boy nick welcome <laughs> to the server it is it is definitely a <laughs> he says hi youtube it is definitely a very fragile thing and especially to talk about and to, to emotionally like tell you about it a lot of people are not going to like what i'm saying right now they're going to be like, no, Coach, you're, no, you're my friend. I care. Okay? Doesn't make us friends. I don't want you to think that there's a friendship relationship here. Friends, like my friends, I call on the phone, we hang out, our families get together, we have barbecues. That's my friends. Okay? This relationship that we have across the internet, there's some people I have that are friends. And I talk to them directly through Twitter and I, I like have an um, like a relationship with them but it's not this okay this right here is recording I recorded content I'm here to entertain to help you understand and this goes for all content creators whoever they are whatever you think your relationship is with them um, this also goes for entertainers. <sighs> Fangirling and boy bands. It's been going on since I was in elementary school. Since I was in middle school. And these, these NSYNC, um, Backstreet Boys, um, Justin Bieber, guys. Fangirling is like super support and you don't have to be a girl to do fangirling. Okay. It is super supportive. And me as a, an entertainer, content creator, uh, celebrity status, whatever you want to call it. I eat it up because I'm ADHD. It's super supportive, but it can be super, super unhealthy. Okay. Super unhealthy. It depends on the individual and it depends on who you are and what the, the mental state you're in. But you know, if you, if you want to fangirl, go for it. Um, or if you want to call it fanboying or fan dimming, whatever you want to call it, um, super supportive. Just don't make it unhealthy. Okay. I want you to understand the relationship that is YouTube to fan or whatever you want to call it. That's one thing like people saying you're my biggest fan kind of, it does. It kind of gets to me sometimes. I'm like, um, that's not mine. Hold on. Is that one mine? Hold on. This one's, that one's mine. There we go. So I'm going to grab a couple of these and we're just going to set them up around the base at the bottom. So it feels, you're not putting that in my car, right? Okay, cool. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes, I would like that one, please. Thank you. So let's go ahead and grab these. And if you didn't see it yesterday, um, the video with Jingle. Hi, Gamer Boy Nick. YouTube hugs! <laughs> By the way, if you do happen to meet me in real life, I am a hugger and I do hug. I give hugs like crazy. Um, it's kind of a running gag with my family. Because whenever we have um, family get-togethers on my uh, mom's side, I've got to make sure that I do the rounds. I've got to hug everyone. If if you try and get out of uh, giving me a hug, that's your problem. Because I'm coming after you. Um, I do I do the same. Like <clears throat> if you happen to be the boyfriend of, or a girlfriend of one of my um, relatives who is at the get together, you're getting a hug. If you happen to be the friend of somebody who showed up at a family get together, you're getting a hug. Everybody gets a hug at the, the get together. You know what? Haven't used a beta axe in a long time. Let's use a beta. Here we go. 
How's it work on Palm? Two, oh, three hits. Three hits and done. Nicely done. Can I give you stuff? <laughs> I did, I did, <laughs> I did say if you, if you joined me, you could. <laughs> I could. Oh. <laughs> I was about to say I could use money, but <laughs> uh, you guys just saw me give away 10 mil. La 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 la. Oh, hold on. Why is it? There we go. There we go. Can you give me axe, please? Dude, I will not whitelist anyone. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm not white listing anyone today. Thank you. Am I in a video? Yes. You are in a vid. It comes out tomorrow. He's like, yay! It does, like... Now that I've kind of got that out of the way, I feel much better. Just, that's been kind of weighing on me for the last couple of days of this idea that people are obsessed with my, with my content. I mean, I get comments all the time like, oh my God, your content's so good. Why is it good? Like you can, you can say it all day long, but until I have like a reasoning behind it or like some kind of emotional state, some kind of clarification, maybe that's me. Maybe I just need justification for what I do. But I feel like just saying, oh, you have good content. It's kind of like, oh, okay. And if you just made a comment down below, like, oh my God, I love your videos. Don't delete it. Don't edit it. I want to read that. Okay, I like those. I, I, I love that you've left a comment for me to read and I get a chance to come through all the comments and, and check them out, okay? Don't take it as I don't want those those little comments like high code. For those of you who are like, I bet code won't pin this, you're right, I won't. If that's the only thing you wrote, there's no possible way you will ever get pinned. For me to pin somebody's comment means you made a comment straight from your heart. Whoa, what in the world? <laughs> Invisible toilet. In fact, it's it's actually still there. It's just very tiny. It's a tiny toilet. Tiny toilet bowl, tiny toilet bowl. Boom, there we go, tiny toilet. It's not useful, but... <laughs> Oh gosh, I'm, I'm gonna set the toilet bowl off to the side for a moment. Thank you to the person that donated to me uh, last time. I really appreciate it. Here we go. Now I wonder, should I keep that away from the wall a little bit? Nah, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. We're good. We're good. Hmm. Hmm. What's that gonna do for the bridges? I wonder. I wonder if I'm gonna have to make bridges. You're gonna have to make bridges, Code. <clears throat> code, I'm working on trying to catch the 250 weapons from fishing. Oh, that's actually really easy. Um, go to the swamp. Slurpy swamps, whatever it's called. And just fish. Keep fishing through the storm. You can fish all, uh, like, two of the storms. Um, drop right next to the factory on the left hand side, or on the the west side, because that's where uh, a boat and a fishing rod are always going to be. That's the that's the fastest way. Oh my gosh, we've been recording for 24 minutes. I'm shaking right now. <laughs> Why are you shaking? <laughs> That's, that's another thing. A lot of people get surprised whenever they do meet me and they start to shake and they're nervous and stuff like that. And I'm like, it's okay. And I didn't realize that was a thing until a lot of people have done it. And they're, they're like, Oh my God, it's gold. I'm like, what are you doing? Calm down. If you'd met anybody else on, on, on the street or in the mall or something, you wouldn't be like, 
You know, it's just, it's me. It's fine. <laughs> Super excitement. Hyper excitement. And I don't know if, is there a condition for that? Is it, is there a word for it? Uh, fanboying? Fangirling? That, that's what I think it is. But I've, I've had it happen multiple times. <laughs> uh, it's fun. It's cool. Uh, to the person that I met at Hope School, you're awesome, and yes, I did see your chats last time. Uh, to the person that I met at GameStop, yes, I did see your content, and I, I no, not, I saw your comments on, there were three of them, on two videos ago. I did read them. Um, for everyone that does not get a response to a comment, I do go through them and read them, even though I may not respond to them. And if you just get a heart, it doesn't mean I'm answering yes or no to anything. It means, hey, I read your comment and I really liked it. Thank you. And I appreciate it. I even heart bad comments sometimes. Some of them are like, you suck. And I'm like, heart, I read that. But it, it gives you engagement and it tells you, hey, yeah, I'm listening. If you see hearts on other comments, but you don't see hearts on your comments, don't reply to it and be like, oh my god, you're a YouTuber, it's just like all YouTubers, you don't ever respond. Guys, I get a lot of comments, okay? And it's not just on YouTube, I get it on Twitter, I get it on um, YouNow, Instagram, Twitch, uh, Discord. Discord's a big one. If I don't respond to you on Discord, I, prob I, I, I will never respond on Discord unless... There's a reason behind me responding on Discord. I won't ever just say hi. There's there's no... I don't find reason in it. Does that make sense? Can I use your palm bridge? Yes. Here, I'm sorry. Let me... Let me set it down for you. Move B. There you go. Off you go. <laughs> You're welcome. I will be making all the outside of this of palm, at least up to the first floor, which I think, if I do this correctly, this should be a first floor. Because that's, that's pretty tall. That should be more than enough for a first floor. Then I could like open these walls up and this could all be a floor. This oh, this is gonna look awesome. Please can you follow me in Roblox? Gamer Boy Nick, yes. Done. <laughs> I'll give a follow. I don't think there's a limit to me following people. Oh dude, 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 dude. Come on. Come on now. What happened? Code, uh, can I show you my friend's code? Can I follow me? Tokyo says, please, can I have an ax? Dude, for me to give you an ax, I would have to whitelist you. I'm not whitelisting anyone. Probably ever. Because there are two many scripters script script kitties and I don't want to risk it I'm sorry no please bro <laughs> why can no one ever just take no as an answer that's an that's another thing I have a problem with like and don't get me wrong, I've been known to not take no for answers. Because most of the time when people tell me, oh, well, it's our policy, I don't care. I don't care if it's your policy or if it's your rules or whatever like that. I do not recognize your authority. <clears throat> that was probably a little bit... <laughs> anti-me, <laughs> anti-code. Um, I don't ever take anything as, oh, this is our policy and we don't allow it to happen. I take it as you need to give me a reason 
why do you have a policy in place? What reason could you possibly have for not allowing something? You know? Okay, that was kind of weird. Okay, so this is the truck that generated from this pad, right? So if I move this pad, technically that pad's no longer there, and is it the same model of pad? It's gotta be. So if I hit this button, that truck should disappear. Okay, makes sense. I'll accept that, that's fine. Ooh, okay. We are going to set up some lights. Turn out the lights and I'll glow. To the extreme, I rock a mic like a vandal. Light up the stage and watch me jump like a candle. Dance with the speakers that boom. Poison in your brain like a poisonous mushroom. Deadly. When I hear a something melody. Flow like a harpoon daily and nightly. Will it ever stop? Yo, I don't know. Turn out the lights and I'll glow. Sorry. <clears throat> That's some vanilla ice right there. Back from when I was like nine years old. One of the first rappers that I ever listened to. And yes, I listened to rap. This looks so much better lit up like this. Uh, in fact, I could probably spread this out a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to be using some work lights here. <laughs> that looks awesome. Oh, I really like the way that the those light up. Oh my gosh, I don't know why that lighting looks so good. I hate the the casing that they're in. Defaultio. I have an idea. We need tap lights. <laughs> okay, so you know the, like, it's the exact same thing as this work light right here, but can you make it flat? So this right here is flat. All right, none of the yellow, no handle, and a little push button. Take, like, take this push button, put it just off to the side here, and then make this like a portrait. Boom, slap it on the wall, bam. You would, you would have this light, this lighting system, like, like that on the wall. I wonder. This is a physical, physical object, so it doesn't anchor down to anything. Is there any possible way to anchor that to something? Um, by the way, this is what I was talking about the other day. If we take a small tile, right? Place it over the top of this, and we do a turn, do one to the side, do one to the side, and then a rotate, do one like that, boom. Okay, let me fill these in real quick. Uh, we'll use cherry wood, since this cherry wood happens to be here. Come on, be one piece. Not enough, 48%. Uh, okay, 48 means I need another one. About the same size for 50. Ninety-seven percent. Okay. Ninety-seven percent. Come here. There we go. Okay. So that was a lot of wood. <coughs> oh man. Oh, why can't I get this today? Here, you know what? Just go. Or that one works too. That one works too. <clears throat> oh, we've been recording for 34 minutes. Whoops. All right, there we go. Come on, there we go. I want to do this real quick and then I will show it to you. Good. Okay, so we have our four four edges. Uh, what I can do is I can move this one out. 
Move. And then we're going to grab this, get it out of the way. And I can move these. Move. Gonna go one there. Move. One right here. Oh, oh. And then we can slide this in here. But we're going to have to be able to put the the plate back in place and it's just too big for it to be there with this. All right, so what you've got to do is you got to move this, get it lined up, rotate, rotate, get it lined up and place it, but then you're going to move it again. Just hit move and then gr grab your light. You're just going to slide it in there like that and going to hit B. Boom. See? Kind of like a little pumpkin. In fact, I think you can do this with pumpkins. Hmm. Hmm. Come here, green pumpkin. Hold on. Might possibly be able to do this with pumpkins. Let's see. Move you out of the way. Move you. Come on, get in there. May not be able to do this with pumpkins. Yeah, pumpkins are just too big. Maybe if we turn it sideways. Whoa. Hold up a second. Did you see that? Oh, okay. I could have sworn I was I was rotating the blueprint in a way it wasn't supposed to be able to rotate. Huh. Oh well. Oh well. Okay, we're gonna stick this back in there. Oh wait, no, 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 no. We gotta take this out, and then we gotta place this in. We're gonna place it right here, like that, and then we're going to move this, and then we can place this one in. Oh, oh. Boom. Come on, get in there. Did it work? Get in there. And B. There we go. I'm going to push this to the center, and we're all set. Now, what might kind of, like, you could, you don't want to do that with a glass, because then you'd see it. Okay, outro time. Outro time thank you everyone for watching this episode of lumber tycoon 2 with me heath haskins code primate don't forget to like comment subscribe down below if you want to smash the like button to the face save the like buttons don't hit things whatever you want to call it um the the sub button that's the important one all right that's should be right here i think is it, is it right here or is that the like button wherever that subscribe button is, make sure you hit that and turn on the bell. And the reason I say to turn on the bell is because then you can get notifications of all these awesome videos that come out that I talk to you and, and stuff. And like I said, um, okay. And honesty for a second, I don't hit the bell for a lot of things. I have some select few that I actually turn the bell on to. I subscribe to a lot of people, but honestly, the bell's kind of an optional thing. I want to be notified of your video when it comes out and I want it on my feed, but I don't want an email every single time. Does that make sense? I hope that makes sense. And I understand if you don't hit the bell, but you know, I encourage it. Hit the bell, new content all the time, every single day. Love you guys very much. Have a great night. Happy new year. We'll talk to you very soon. <sighs> Outro. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait, do you guys see the hoodie that's down there? The the hoodie? I'm going to go and purchase one of those for myself. I don't know if you want one as well. But a lot of you don't know this. On the back of the hoodie, it says outro on the back. So check that out if you want. That's from Teespring, I think. And it goes through YouTube. So uh, it's a lot different than Hello Juniper. 
And I'm not going to tell you don't or do buy either one. Because one's not better than the other. Um, the quality is still really good. The only difference is Hello Juniper is from Canada. So they have like a big shipping charge that's different because they're shipping outside the U.S. Anyhow, just saying. Yeah, I don't, I don't want to contradict anything that's going to make contracts conflict. Anyhow, that's it. Outro.